Hey, Barbier, 14-3 win against ULM, and Coach, uh, no better way to take some confidence with you and get a big midweek win and get it where you were uh, able to get a lot of guys some time and see a lot of career first tonight. Yeah, it was good to get guys out there. You know, hadn't been out there a whole lot. Those guys work, you know, I mean, they work. And, and guys like Peyton Davis, who, who didn't even make the trip um, last weekend, to, to not put his head down and pout, to come out and get a big knock um, like he did, he'll be rewarded for that. You know, the game rewards the ones that work. So it's good to see those guys get out here and have good days. Luke Watson and I talked. He said, you know, I've hit more barrels that have been caught in a long time. He got one that got out and really seemed to get you going. Yeah, it's hard to catch him when you hit him over the fence. That's why guys who do it make a lot of money. You know, it's good. Uh, Luke's a, a proven hitter. I mean, he's a, he's a guy that's hit throughout his entire baseball career, and he's going to do that here. Um, so it's good to see him on a barrel tonight. Jerry Maddox had pitched really well at A&M last week. What in his best command but battled and got out and got his first win and really when he got you guys back into the fifth inning that's when things really seemed to change and you guys woke up. I thought he made some big pitches. You know, I thought he made when he when he got in a little bit of trouble, I thought he, he made some big pitches and big spots. Um, you know, it's just one of those things. He's, he's got to come out with a little more command uh, than he had today. You know, like he had right. last week. He was extremely right. sharp last week. Um, so it was it was good to see him. He's got he's got really good stuff. And when you got like stuff like him, it's not easy to command it all the time, especially when he's throwing four different pitches. So um, glad to see him battle through it. That's for sure.